I would like to get to know if I could be The kind of girl that you could be down for Cause when I look at you I feel something tell me That you're the kind of guy that I should make a move on What's up divas and divas? Hey everybody! How are you today? So your girl is back for another video. Let's do this, you guys. What's up, divas? What's up, divos? What's up, YouTube fam? What's up, everybody? Everybody, hope everybody's having like a really good day today. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, just chill, relax. You know, like they say, Netflix and chill, stream and chill. Just just be good you know what i'm saying be cool stay safe all that good stuff i feel like i look a little crazy right now i don't know i did like this shirt when i first got it i mean yeah it was two dollars at walmart a couple years ago and i have a couple of them in every color and a few of them in this color but for some reason today i'm just not feeling this shirt i'm ready to do this video i saved the best for last like i always tell you guys everybody got a favorite everybody got a best Quite a few companies that I really do Fs with, like that are my peoples, that have like some decent wigs, that have some good wigs, like they do the damn thing, like, you know what I'm saying, they reputable, I've worked with them a million and one times. Anything else? So I did get a new tattoo, which says my son Wuzzle's name, and it's some angel wings and a halo, and the halo is outlined in gold, the wings are outlined in blue, and his name is outlined in purple. They get that touched up. The color was so bad in it after probably like 15 years of this tattoo. The color was like horrible. All the color was gone. They did a good job and hooked it up for your girl. Back on my journey of tattoo. Yo, from my peoples at Divas Wigs, they did send me one of their ultra super fine HD Swiss lace frontal. Anything else? Okay. And it's already bleached and pre-plucked for you, but of course your girl always does a little bit extra. So I did pre-pluck it. Let me tell you guys, this hair is so daggone soft. Like this hair is actually so pretty. This is why I saved the best for last. I did do two others prior to this, but this is the one that I saved. I'm never disappointed with Diva's wigs. I mean, okay, one time I was. Ooh, is that shape? <laughs> Their wigs have really changed. I like the curl pattern in it. The hair, though, is gorgeous. The texture of the hair is what I'm, like, really, really impressed with. Plus, they do their own little cameo bleach knots, you know what I'm saying? But sometimes they may not be too bleached, so you can either do it yourself again, or you can just fill it in with a tinting spray or whatever. I do have a little bit of knots in here that are not too bleached, but I may not need anything because this is ultra fine Swiss HD. The unit does come with the standard combs, but Diva's Wigs also provides a removable black elastic band. Now, this company never skimps, never does wrong when it comes to their elastic bands, especially the ones that you can remove. I've had every single one except for Diva's Wigs and quite a few other companies, a couple other companies that I did not have to remove the entire thing. They know where to sew these at. Like some people be sewing them. Some companies be sewing right on the lace. I'm going to show you guys how your wig come. And then, you know, we're going to jump right into it. When you receive your unit from Divas Wigs, you receive it in their standard white packaging, which states since 2012. Divas Wigs will also provide amenities such as their paddle brush, which will easily detangle your unit and your own natural hair. Along with that, you'll also receive a elastic band, which you can remove and adjust in size. You'll also receive a two-piece wig cap, which will protect your hair from your unit. Along with that, Diva's wigs will also provide some disposable face masks. In your package, you will find a Divas Wigs pamphlet, which will give you their guidelines for refunds, returns, and exchange. They will also provide a satin pouch bag to store your unit in. Check out ChicHouse.com where you can find plenty of dresses, tops, bottoms, wigs, jewelry, swimwear, and lots more. 
at a discounted rate. I'll leave the link below where you can save an extra $5 off of your purchase. The unit that I received is their super fine HD invisible undetectable seamless Swiss transparent lace wig. This is a curly human hair lace front wig and her name is Leah. I do have her in 16 inches with a 150% density. The unit has been pre-bleached for you, which Diva's wig calls the cameo knots. You will not need to bleach or pre-pluck the unit, but I went ahead and just added a little bit more bleach to the front hairline. And I allow that to sit on for about 10 minutes. Once you co-wash this unit, the curls will appear more natural and defined. Make sure you check out Diva's Wigs as they've been around since 2012 and have many units to choose from at affordable prices. I'll link all of their information below. guys I'm not gonna hold you for too long because you already know the steps I went ahead and cut the lace off the lace is very nice transparent HD Swiss super fine it is very invisible you know what I'm saying so if you want a good wig you can definitely check out Diva's wigs I'm just gonna take some of the hair off of the frontal hairline portion and I like to do this because it also helps me adhere the wig you don't have to use this as baby hairs or wispy hairs you can just use this to do your parting so that way you can adhere your wig and this is only for hairspray you cannot adhere your wig like this with glue um but only hairspray or gel you can only do this method with hairspray and maybe even like a styling mousse but definitely not the glue or the gel because it will definitely get messy i prefer using either bedhead or got to be glam force because it's an easy removal it'll last on your head for about three to four days and maybe you'll need to apply it at the edges but the cleanup process is definitely easy and this product dries a lot quicker. So as you've seen, I did spray some on the inside of the cap and then I went ahead and sprayed some on the outside where I parted that and I'm just gonna take my blow dryer on a cool heat and just use my rat tail comb and press into the lace so that way I know that it is adhered down. And you just repeat that all around. If you don't have a blow dryer, then just do the steps a uh, little bit by little bit so that it'll dry. And you just repeat that on the opposite side. So now it's time to kind of like customize these wispy hairs if I decide to use them or sideburn hairs, you know. Like I stated, you don't have to with this unit because the lace is very transparent and invisible, but sometimes you do like maybe a curl or two swinging in the front hairline and you definitely may like some sideburns like your girl. And as normally, I like to use my green toothbrush and my styling mousse from the Dollar Tree, which I find is really good. I did used to use the styling mousse by Got To Be, but I did notice that one particular brand by St uh, Got To Be was making my wig lift up. So it's something in the product that was allowing the wig to 
um, you know, get loose or loosen or unadhere, whatever you want to call it. So I just went back to the Dollar Tree mousse. It's a dollar, it's cheaper, and I never have any issues with it. So I use that to scope down any type of hairs on the side and the hairs on the hairline. And as I stated, you really don't need any type of baby hairs with this unit because what lace do you see, girl? None. Make sure you check Diva's wigs out because I've been rocking with them for so many years and they are one of my ride or die wig companies. So now I'm just going to blow dry some of these little sculpted hairs and you know the rest girls. I'll see you in the ending. Oh yeah. And this is just my elastic band that I sewed together. This will help adhere the wig or lay it down. I like to sleep in this. It's better than sleeping in a scarf because it's not hot and it's less tension. And then I'm just going to spray some of my water that has some of the leave-in conditioner in it because they hair curl pattern did come out a little bit and I'm just going to blow dry some of it but it's easy peasy okay cause I know it will be hard to make in love with you love is in the air tonight I am yours so hold me tight love is in the air tonight texture is gorgeous the lace is not even there i'm glad i didn't have to use any of my tinting sprays because girl look what lace like this wig diva's wigs i'm gonna say this and i'm gonna say it again they have definitely evolved this wig i'm giving it a 10 i'm definitely giving this a 10 For one, the black elastic removable band was right on point, right where it needs to be. It fit snug. It was the right length, like the right size. I didn't have to cut off any extra hair and lace on the sides. Look, I didn't have to use any tinting spray. Like, seriously, this wig went on like a piece of cake, honey. No, security! Is that like the right terminology? I hope so. So I give them their props. This definitely gets a 10. I gave two 10s today, honey. Like seriously, these wig companies are showing out and I'm here for it. Period. So undetectable, invisible, Swiss, super fine HD Swiss lace. Girl, get you a wig from Divas Wigs, okay? Okay. Divas Wigs definitely is one of those companies where you can get you a real transparent HD Swiss lace, honey. So 16 inches, more or less, to me, looks like 18. And if you straighten it, it's going to get even longer. So I think this, like, for their 16, they did a really good job on this wig. The length, the volume. Girl, the hair is so pretty. Like, seriously, this hair is so pretty. And you could do so many things with this hair because it's 16 inches. To me, it looks like 18, but you could put it up in a bun. You could do so many different things with this. I would suggest when you want to saturate or you want the curls to pop back, I would deeply, strongly suggest co-washing it. I did spritz some of the water on it from my spray bottle. This does have conditioner in it. You notice when you spray the hair down, the curls are a little stringy. They're, they're not like that great versus like the curls that you can get when washing it, which is super defined and just really juicy. So I would highly suggest when you're trying to get those curls to back to pop it again, 
co-wash it. Don't saturate your entire head with a bottle of water. Your 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 hair is gonna look like dried up jerry curl for real. I've never had a jerry curl in my life, and I'm I'm trying to start right now. I told you guys I saved the best for last, hunties. Okay, so make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, show them some love, show them some love. And if you ever bought a wig from Diva's Wigs, comment below of what your thoughts was on that wig. So on that note, you girls and guys, gals, you know, I have to go. That was my last video, but I got to clean up my mess. You know what I'm saying? So I love you all. Stay diva and delicious. Stay safe. Stay blessed. And definitely stay cute. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Get him, spin him, unless I'm shooting the denim. I put the records on him. Big mans can't bend him. Ops, we hit him. Fuck him off, he bend him.